As dog parents, we want to share everything with our pets. We want them to go wherever we go. We want them to be able to enjoy the same things we do. We think if it's good for us, it must be good for them, right? But there are some things that you should never ever share with your dogs. Today I want to share with you seven things that are good for people, which are not good for dogs. Number one, chocolate and cacao. These are actually neurotoxins for your dog. So although you enjoy it, never ever share anything with chocolate in it with your dog. Number two, grapes and raisins. Grapes are a tasty snack and they seem like they should be healthy, but for dogs, they're actually toxic. Number three, candies and gum. Candy actually has a chemical called xylitol in it, which is not great for people even, but it's even worse for your pets. So never ever ever let your dogs get a hold of candies or some gums that have that xylitol in them. Number four, garlic and onions. Now it's a little debatable whether garlic and onions are actually that bad for your dog, but in general, unless they have some reason to eat them, it's best to completely avoid them. Number five, chili and other spices. So some spices are okay, like turmeric, which in Hindi is haldi. But other than that, it's best to just avoid all spicy food for your dog. So the next time you go out to a restaurant, that doggy bag is for you, not for your pet. Number six, human medication. Just because it works on you doesn't mean it'll work on your dog. And you would never take your dog's painkillers, so why would you give them yours? It's best just to go to a veterinarian and get a proper prescription for your pet. Number seven, human cosmetics. So this is things like, obviously makeup, but shampoos even. Human shampoo, it can actually irritate a dog's skin further. If you don't have a dog shampoo and you're in a pinch, you can actually use Vim, which is just a normal dish soap. And that's actually better for your dog's skin than your own shampoo. And the last thing is, when in doubt, talk to your veterinarian or just Google it. There's a lot of information out there. Are you curious about some food or item that you want to share with your dog? Leave us a comment below and I'll answer all of your questions. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to get a notification anytime we have a new video.